right, so to start off, I'm going to be priming my face with this Benefit Professional Primer. And I chose this one because I absolutely love it. It really shrinks my pores and then just helps contain my oils all day. And as you can see, I'm focusing it right on my T-zone and all of my acne area. So for foundation, I'm using these two drugstore full coverage foundations, the L'Oreal True Match and the Maybelline Superstay Better Skin Foundation. Love these on their own, super full coverage, very pretty matte finish, but together they just make just a beautiful combination. And I'm using it with a beauty blender because I wanted to diffuse some of the full coverageness, I guess, so it doesn't look as built up but a lot of times I just use a brush and it gives you a lot more coverage than a beauty blender does so just keep that in mind um, I decided to use a beauty blender this time just because I knew I was going to go in with concealer and stuff but um, usually if I don't use concealer I will use a brush if that makes any sense but yeah so beauty blender for less coverage a brush for more coverage but these two foundations are just excellent for coverage in general <laughs> So for concealer, I'm just highlighting my under eyes and then a little bit on my chin. And for that, I'm using the Maybelline Super Stay Better Skin Concealer. So I'll have all of the products I listed down below as, long, as well as the colors in case you missed it or I'm going too fast. I feel like I always go fast on these kind of tutorials. <laughs> so I'm just using this concealer because I really love how full coverage it is and I just wanted to be flawless. So the foundation and concealer just go hand in hand together if you haven't tried it you really need to and also i'm going to be using the powder later on and you can just see how pretty the finish of all these three together are so for concealer i'm using this nyx concealer palette just this darkest shade right here just going over my acne where um, I saw that it was kind of peeking through just a little bit. I just wanted a little bit extra coverage. I wanted to show y'all what products I use. I don't use concealer like this on a day-to-day -day basis, but girl, my skin is bad. So sometimes you just have to go on with extra products. So I wanted to show y'all this concealer. It's really good. It stays all day and it's super creamy. So for setting powder, I'm using this Rimmel Stay Matte Powder. You've seen me use this before. It's just in the shade Translucent. I'm using it on the inner part of my face just to kind of brighten it up and just go over my concealer. So for the outer perimeters of my face, I'm going in with this Maybelline Superstay Better Skin um, Powder just to kind of give my face a little bit more color to kind of match it to the rest of my skin because the translucent does kind of make it a little bit lighter. And then I went in with a sponge from that powder palette thing and just went over my acne just a little bit more. I find that it locks in the foundation and concealer and just really gives it that extra full coverage if that's what you're going for, which obviously I am. <laughs> so I did my bronzer and blush um, on camera just so you can kind of see that these products um, they do not move the foundation or concealer around and they are super pretty on the skin So like I said, I'll have everything listed down below in case you missed it. So I included a, a little um, Title thing in a, in a second, but I went ahead and finished my the rest of my makeup off camera If you would like a tutorial on that eyeshadow look, just let me know But yeah, this is the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed it Don't forget to like my video if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe. So I will see y'all in my next video. Bye y'all.